This is the Emmanuel Family Devotion for Friday, February the 12th. We look again at this coming Sunday by looking at the epistle reading, 2 Corinthians chapter 3, verse 12 through chapter 4, verse 6. Pause the video, read 2 Corinthians 3, verse 12 through chapter 4, verse 6. More masks in the epistle reading. In fact, masks abound. Paul says essentially that God's glory is masked in the Old Covenant. Oh, it is there, just masked. It is there in the Passover, where the spotless lamb sheds his blood to free God's people from slavery. God's glory is masked in the law of God. Those expectations of God are right and holy, just unreachable by us. Many in Jesus' day just could not shake the masks and see that the old covenant was being replaced, being fulfilled by a new covenant. Peter was masked and could not see Jesus for who he was and what he came to do. When Jesus spoke about fulfilling his purpose in coming by dying and rising, Peter blurted out, No way, not on my watch. Many remain masked today and are unable to see God for who He is. And in fact, we are born masked, born unable to see God in truth and light. But by God's grace and His action in the message of the gospel, many have had their masks removed and they can see God for who He is, the God who loves us and sent His Son as payment for our sin. Only as God has lifted the mask can we see Him. Only as God has lifted our mask can we begin to reflect His glory into our world. And so, unmasked, we speak of Christ. God has removed our masks. Some people will see Christ and as their Savior, thanks be to God. Others will tie that mask securely to their face and refuse to see. And our text tells us why. The God of this world has blinded the minds of unbelievers to keep them from seeing the light of the gospel of the glory of Christ, who is the image of God. We grieve such masked unbelief. But we do not lose heart, because the unmasking is not our task. It is always God's task. We trust Him to do His work according to His will. Remember the original Batman television show? The bad guys were continually trying to unmask Batman. None ever succeeded. Good triumphed over evil. This Sunday, Jesus will be unmasked, and we will see Him for who He is, God in human flesh. You will see it, because God has removed your mask. Please pray with me. Heavenly Father, thank You for allowing me to see Jesus unmasked, Your Son and my Savior. Use me and my voice to be the instrument of unmasking in the lives of people around me. In Jesus' name, amen. We'll see you tomorrow.